Hello, my name is Michael Jones and I am an educator, someone who is passionate about and trained in the art of teaching. For over a decade, I've worked in education and nonprofit governance. I've taught multiple ages and subjects and worked in both the developed and developing worlds. I've worked with local, national, and international nonprofits who focus on youth empowerment, protection, and education. Because of my background, I know that teaching is more than instruction. It's using the facts your students are expected to know as a medium to inspire curiosity and ignite intellectual growth. Most recently, my focus has been working with an organization to provide high quality pedagogy in the context of developing countries. We've written, designed, and edited lesson books that help teachers truly teach science, social studies, mathematics, and English. Alongside these tools, I've developed quantitative objective measures of teacher effectiveness, and I've helped them to adjust their programs in ways that more efficiently provide high quality education to the students they serve. Now, I'm ready to increase the impact my work will have on the developing world. My goal is straightforward, to empower individuals, organizations, and governments in developing countries with resources to provide high quality educational opportunities to their students. The key here is high quality. High quality teaching uses the subject matter as a medium to train students in critical thinking, creativity, and problem solving. Skills necessary and applicable in any context. The goal is not simply to lead students to the answer, but to empower them to develop their own questions and eventually their own answers. While many resources available in the developed world claim to provide students with this sort of education, they vary in quality and are almost always cost prohibitive. This kit, designed for a single class in the developed world, costs $175, requires transport of a box that's too big, and necessitates extensive translation. The truth is, this entire kit is based on a very basic lesson that can be considered a staple in any primary grade teacher's repertoire. Really, all you need to provide this lesson to students in any country are some containers, vegetable starch, and a plan. I was able to empower Cambodian teachers to provide four days of exploration with Ublek, a non-Newtonian fluid, to 250 students for about $20. Another lesson provides students with the opportunity to design and test paper boats. It's two days of collaboration, exploration, design, experimentation, redesign, and learning, and it can be done for hundreds of students for roughly a dollar. Students can explore states of matter with the materials that can be found on a walk to school. They can learn about erosion and soil composition with nothing but dirt. They can examine weather with old plastic bags and bottles. With some creative planning and resource utilization, we can provide an education that teaches the material and develops students' critical thinking and creativity, as well as anywhere in the world for free. Young learners can pick up some objects on the way to school, dig a hole, hang some plastic bags, and do it in a way that employs the best research and the best methods to give them the highest quality of education possible. But wait, we don't have to stop with lessons. We can equip NGOs and departments of education with program models that efficiently and inexpensively transmit these lessons to schools in their target areas, while simultaneously training teachers to produce new lessons on their own. We can help everyone working in education do their job a little bit better, and we can make every dollar spent on educational development do a lot more. This need exists throughout the developing world, and not only lessons, but program design and administrative guidance will be needed to provide it. I plan to create compartmentalized kits for improving education in developing countries. These kits will have everything needed to open a school or community center, teach classes, hold training, start an educational NGO, or design education programs within an existing NGO. Two things will make what I do truly effective. First, everything I create will be fully compartmentalized. Contents can be used in whole to raise an educational system from the ground up, or taken piece by piece to run trainings or simply teach lessons as a two-week volunteer. Second, I will develop partnerships with successful NGOs in countries around the world. These partnerships will not only produce new materials, but will allow us to have native speakers translate materials into numerous languages, align them with government curricula, and think of different ways to facilitate distribution, making them accessible to an even wider range of education professionals. Building schools, hiring teachers, and making books is a great start, but it can't be where we stop. We must be committed to providing students everywhere an educational experience that rivals the quality of instruction received in any developed country. I know that we can empower educators to do it, and I know that we can give that empowerment for free. Thank you.